building a partnership together my goodness for two uh, single persons that can channel the nine of pentacles energy uh, this can be quite quite a chance there is something better for you and this flow of energies guys should be an encouragement and i think that it is fair to um end the reading with this um beautiful message because it can even be the chance to um to be together with a new lovely partner Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Quick general love reading for my friends Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Whenever you watch this, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If you resonate, let us know, like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for the support. So guys, let's find out together what's coming through for you. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus in the love arena. Let's see what we can get for you guys. Healing heart, healing from heartbreak. Freedom from toxic relationship or addiction. I like you. Someone likes you. Romance is blooming. Fun. Flirting. Want to date. Abundance. Bottom of the deck. Keep a positive mindset. Manifest exactly what you want. Gratitude and bliss. So, for some of you, this can be about a transition from an old cycle, an old situation towards a new one and there can also be an understandable time factor involved trust major factor for me there is something better and get more information bottom of the deck let's see if it is about the opportunity to get to know a new person a little bit better let's see what the tarot has to say about these energies here we go so your energies guys the tower four of pentacles Knight of Wands, the Hermit. Your person's energy is King of Pentacles, Ten of Wands, the Empress, Nine of Wands, Meeting Energies, Page of Cups, Ten of Swords, Queen of Wands, the Chariot, our Focus, Strength Card, bottom of the deck eight of pentacles extremely productive as an energy it's about a mindset determination dedication there is a drive an attention to every little detail that can make the difference in favor of an outcome this is a new person guys but some of you may have indeed left behind a chapter that may have ended even unexpectedly because the tower can be a sudden shift you know there is a divine bolt that lands on the tower and everything crumbles down then there is the four of pentacles which is a defensive mode let's say because some of you can close yourself for protection when it comes to new interactions but bottom of the eight of pentacles we have the full which should be basically a new chapter a new beginning let's say an opportunity that can be embraced if we realize that there can be trust between us and a new person some of you can be absolutely cautious when it comes to the opportunity to evaluate new interactions because you may fear let's say to encounter a player knight of wands because maybe a player character was by your side in the situation that crumbled down and so there can be a healing process about that 
the Ten of Swords is the ending that can follow the tower, guys. Some of you can still be in the process of overcoming the obstacles that can be associated to the closing of a previous um, connection, relationship, cycle. But this energy can also uh, speak about this person because after all they get the Ten of Wands and the Nine of Wands. Wounded Warrior and the Ten of Wands man, which is someone that is taking care of tasks and duties of the everyday life with a great deal of responsibility and maturity but also someone that is looking for the moment of relief that can kind of represent a reward for the effort that has been put in favor of the journey, you know? This person may have left behind also um, a situation that was not for them. Now they are in a different position because they may look for a partner that can join forces with them in order to manifest a healthy growth, the Empress. I love the combination King of Pentacles Empress because this person can be absolutely comfortable when it comes to the opportunity to balance their masculine and feminine side. they can have a sensibility that is uh, truly remarkable because it can play in their favor extremely grounded trustworthy they can value trust as much as uh, you guys can value it and they do not want to open up easily also so you get the four of pentacles the man is keeping the pentacle extremely close to his chest heart chakra and this person gets the wounded warrior the wall is up for protection, you know? And this trend card, as our focus, is about holding back. The two of you may avoid to jump right away in a new connection simply because you do not want to get hurt, because maybe you do not know um, well enough the new person. That's why the get more information should be an encouragement this can even be a connection work related for some of you because the eight of pentacles is a productive energy after all but what if you can understand and recognize that trust which is a factor uh, in the strength card for me uh, can play in favor of your interaction maybe you can like each other quite a lot because we have the queen of wands and a simple act of kindness and uh, love sweet and sincere like the page of cups can be can ignite a domino effect that can lead towards success the chariot auspicious energy positive it's about the future basically keep a positive mindset and for me it gets the feeling wishing upon a star and allowing the star to guide the chariot to the place where it is supposed to be so guys mm, let's go for a couple of energies i am curious about the four of pentacles because it is a cautious approach but at some point um, the posture has to change because we have to open up in order to grant new connections to to be manifested properly, let's say. Death card, which is a transformation. It is fair to say that you do not want any part with playerish uh, characters that can try to seduce and conquer you guys. Look, Knight of Wands, on point, thank you. And the Ten of Swords, it's done, done, done over so basically that's why the protection mode it is well justified or well explained basically um, it's understandable again that's why the hermit can be a moment of solitude in order to dive deeper into an introspection some of you may truly sharpen up your 
talents in order to spot if someone is not reliable enough or if they can have intentions that are not serious in favor of a connection. Let's see, let's see the nine of wands for the one that can become your new person because there is a defensive approach also at play for them. The magician, they can be willing to take action if they realize that the other person can be one deserving of trust. Four of cups, they can be they can be out of reach. They can be uh, also a little bit reluctant to try again in the love arena. There is a mirror effect, basically, guys. You can mirror each other. But what if this plays as a factor in favor of your connection? The past plays a role also in the Four of Cups. And the Nine of Pentacles, Lady single this person but we can also say that they are looking for a fair companion and that's why they can see you guys as someone that can share virtues and values and also why not aspirations so guys uh, in order to embrace a new connection we have to leave behind the struggles and the leftovers from the past let's see if we can get some more information about the Ten of Swords. Two of Cups. The Hermit. I love it. My goodness. And the King of Cups. Emotional maturity. This is what can allow this connection to take off because the ending that can be about some of you and some of uh, your future persons, I would say, can allow the two of you to think things straight, to heal, to recharge, to regroup, Four of Swords, and you may understand what can be the factors that you have to take into consideration at the 100% in order to grant, in favor of a new connection, the chance to be embraced. The Two of Cups is an energy about love, of course, but also an energy blessed with trust, and some of you and some of these persons are looking for a connection that you can trust. And it seems that you can find each other along the way. So, romance is blooming. And also someone likes you, but it can also go vice versa. And there can be success, guys, because the Queen of Wands should be an encouragement following this trend card when it comes to the ability to channel our most powerful and healthy self-confidence and the queen is intuitively guided so she can recognize what can be the opportunity truly deserving of her attention time effort and loving energies so let's ask for guidance guys considering these energies here we go, we get a bunch of cards, making a choice, this can be a choice for love, leaving behind disappointments, this can be true for the two of you, but then the journey can offer in your favor a new connection that can be a promising one, a successful one, and there can be the need to make a choice in favor of it. Magic stream going with the flow there is also a lovely vibe about healing in this card it can follow the four of swords you can even decide to give this connection a chance because it flows naturally like it's easy for the two of you to understand each other commitment this can be a desire, guys. Maybe the two of you didn't have the chance to find it before. The King of Pentacles can be an energy about commitment. There is a key with the word heart on it. Chance to open our heart once again into the unknown. There can be 
there can be a sense um, of indecision, I would say, kind of should I try with this person, what if they are like the ones um, of the past, you know, but this is an exercise of the mind, like the Nine of Swords, that may not be necessary. We have the Fool, and the Fool somehow, some way, is a leap of faith towards something that can be about the unknown, uh, a new journey. And bottom of the Fool, we have the Two of Swords, which is our choice, and bottom of the Two of Swords, we have not just the Sun, but the Ace of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles. So, quite auspicious in favor of the new connection, I would say. Then we get flying, which is lovely because this can be an opportunity to fly up in the sky because the connection is a pleasure and it can also be the chance to leave behind disappointments of the past. And Golden Palace, which can be the, the Ten of Pentacles type of energy that we have seen, building a partnership together. My goodness, for two uh, single persons that can channel the Nine of Pentacles energy, uh, this can be quite, quite a chance. There is something better for you. And this flow of energies, guys, should be an encouragement. And I think that it is fair to... Um, and the reading with this um, beautiful message because it can even be the chance to um, to be together with a new lovely partner so guys i hope that i made myself clear and this was helpful let us know if you resonate comment like share subscribe to the channel until next time i wish you the best take very good care of you and i will talk to you soon bye